when the script came to you, what were your initial thoughts about it, and and what appealed? Uh, what about the project appealed to you guys to sort of jump on board? It was kind of a combination of things. Obviously, you start with the script, and the script was phenomenally good, and the parts were really, really well written. And then I got to see, you know, Buried that Rodrigo made, mm. and also his first film in Spanish, uh, The Contestant, which is an amazing so film. Good. And then, of course, you know, this incredible cast came on board, so it was like. It couldn't get any better, really. Um, and we shot it in Barcelona, so it was a it was a real kind of a dream gig, really. Okay, that's a good Barcelona for like U.S. I was just in Barcelona like last year, and I would not have guessed in a million years. They did it good. It, most of the interiors we did like the exteriors in Toronto, but most, uh, okay. yeah. Did it feel more like a, a studio picture in a way? It was kind of like the biggest set I'd ever been on. I'd only done things that were like dime budgets, so. It felt really, I've, I've never felt like I've been treated better in my life. <laughs> it was so nice. And they, and, and the Spanish crews are just unbelievable. They work so fast. And I would find out like the next day that they shot things that were supposed to be shot the following day because they were ahead of schedule, mm -hmm. which never happens. Before you even read this script or your feelings, did you believe in paranormal, paranormal activity? Do you think it exists or are you more on the skeptic side? Um, I'd definitely be a skeptic, I'd say. Um, but, you know, I am, I think it's, what makes it so interesting, sort of dramatically, is the fact that people want to believe so desperately and people will set aside logic and rational thought and evidence and everything because they need to have this desire for whatever reason, you know, emotionally or whatever, they just need to believe in these things. What was it like to work with um, someone like Sigourney, who, you know, who's pretty much a legend? I was really nervous before and she... She was really awesome, and um, I think it was like my first day on set. She was like, "Hey, can you run lines for tomorrow?" And I was like, "Yeah, absolutely," because I don't know what's gonna come out of my mouth if we don't. Great, but it was. Um, I felt like instantly comforted, and uh, it was just awesome. And also to watch the way she um, works and, and speaks to the director and speaks about her part and how intelligent she is was just so so fun to watch and also to to be in the presence of like such a strong female presence is just always so incredible well, one last quick question about sundance will you have a chance to see other films i heard were you at Re Re uh simon killer yeah i saw simon killer it's amazing you liked it, it was yeah i voted for it for the bestest film <laughs> for competition <laughs>